Hello and welcome back to the Desert Stories. This is Sunita Sharma. Let's have a look at the headlines. The National Committee for Family Affairs on Monday held a meeting during which it discussed the impact of media means on young people, a proposal on childbirth leave for working women, and cases reported to the Public Prosecution Department. The meeting was held under the auspices of Dr. Laila Ahmed Al Nazir, Minister of Social Development, Chairperson of the committee. The General Presidency Agency of the Prophet's Mosque Affairs has intensified its procedure to preserve public health and follow up on worshippers' commitment to preventive and precautionary procedures. It has called on all to adhere to wearing mask, applying physical distancing among queues, and applying preventive guidelines so that worshippers can perform prayers in a safe and healthy environment. The schools in Qatar will remain closed during the Qatar 2022 FIFA World Cup. As per the academic calendar for 2022-23, issued today by the Minister of Education, the half-yearly vacation for schools will start from November 20, 2022 and will end on December 22, 2022. The most anticipated event of the year, Qatar 2022 World Cup will kick off on November 21, 2022 at the Al Bayt Stadium. and the final will be played on december 18 2022 at the lucille stadium 64 matches will be held in the eight world cup stadiums kuwait's cabinet announced monday that the number of employees working in government workplace should not exceed 50 persons starting from wednesday the cabinet said each government agency will determine its appropriate percentage not exceeding the set limit and the decision which is being implemented by the civil service commission will continue until further notice that's all for today stay tuned for more updates till then take care goodbye